Hello, welcome to this video. So tell me what is promiscuous mode? What is it? What is it really and why is it so important for you to understand if you're working with Warshark or any other uh, network sniffing tool, you really want your network interface card where you are running your tool to have the promiscuous mode enabled. Okay. So first of all, let's just talk about this. In today's world, the NIC, the network interface card, it drops all traffic that is not destined to it. Okay. So if you are sending a packet in a in an in a network environment where the packet is destined to you, like if I say a broadcast, and if it's not destined to me, I'm gonna I'm gonna drop it. Okay. Say say we are in a hub type environment okay i'm getting all the packets that are designed to many other computers but my nick is going to drop the packet if the destination ip is not my ip so if you enable the promiscuous mode what it does it does not drop the traffic it will capture and you can use that promiscuous mode for network monitoring so one command is really helpful if you're using Windows to check whether your net adapters, they have the promiscuous mode enabled or not. And if I go to say, just open up my PowerShell and uh, let's just do ISC and uh, let's see if I can paste this command. Okay. And if I run this command right there, is telling me right now at this moment in none of my neck cards okay they got our promiscuous mode on they're all false so that is a default behavior but for a tool like Warshark, okay you when you're capturing packets you really want the network interface card to be in the promiscuous mode now to do and make sure that you have the promiscuous mode enabled you would go to the capture and then you go to the uh, options and for any particular link that you're trying to capture the traffic you select it and make sure that the promiscuous mode is enabled actually this one you should enable and then if you want to enable only for certain interfaces you do it through here okay uh, but you need that okay if you do not have that then you can still capture the traffic but you will be only capturing the traffic that is destined to you so best practice make sure that this is enabled and if you take the mouse over there <laughs> whatsapp is also telling you you probably want to enable this usually a network card will only capture the traffic sent to its own network address if you want to capture all traffic that the network card can see mark this option see the fact for more information things like that okay so that's about it so now you have learned what is promiscuous mode you have learned how to quickly check whether your net adapters are running in a in a promiscuous mode or not and you have also learned how to go to the capture and then options and make sure that you have the promiscuous mode enabled in washer thank you hope it was helpful